join me as we visit Camp Crystal Lake to review the 40th anniversary limited edition Blu-ray Friday the 13th Part 2 Steelbook from Zabi. Hello, welcome back to my channel. So, first thing we're going to have a look at is the outside of this lovely steel book. I personally wasn't going to buy it first of all when I saw it up on sale on Zavi. But I do love Friday the 13th. And I did have a cheeky look of another review. And I saw the back cover and that really did set me off to buy it to be honest so we're well, first of all we're going to do is take j card off so not a paper one but a nice card one i like that jason's out there watching something different for a j card it is and uh, the window bleeding blood with Ginny in on the window and then a write up of the movie and what the special features are very nice indeed so a nice little j card i do like the j cards on my steel box i do keep them i know some people don't bother but uh part of the part of the steel book in my if i feel so that's why i keep it so if we have a look at steel book and i am happy to report there are no dents in this it's not not like my uh, Godzilla one I came from Zavi it is so I'm pretty pleased with that and I gotta admit I know a lot of people are gonna say it's a kind of a plain steelbook design but I thought the same as well but now having it in hand the black is lovely and if you can see just with the light the black background has a little pattern and it looks like a uh, to me it looks like wood like a tree trunk kind of design which is very nice indeed so it's not just a plain black smooth black background it has a bit of a pattern on it and the Friday the 13th part 2 is just exactly what the uh, poster and some of the other covers for the DVDs and that have been like and I, if I'm not mistaken, the old video cassette. Give me two seconds, which I do have in my possession. No. I have the VHS of it as well, but it just has the name on it. So it doesn't have the outline of Jason in the back. But that is very nice indeed. And that's what made me buy this for this not 4k this steel book is a blu-ray steel book i did you're doomed you're all gonna die and the blood trail there and oh, i forgot his name now uh, watched the movie so many times but i'm in uh head head fart today no not knowing that name but uh it'll come back to me but yeah, very nice indeed. And if you notice, see the light again on the background, same pattern on the black all the way around. Spine just has its normal, but if you look at the spine as well, it seems to have the design on the black as well. So very nice indeed. And if we open it up, very nice. I know some people will say it's a bit plain, but I actually like this one. It's really nice. And hopefully they'll bring out more Friday the 13th steel books like this. And I'll make it a one-off with part two. But it seems that it, uh, it looks like it's part two. I can't see them really doing much more else, to be honest. It ain't. So if we open it up as well, keep it back open. The inside has a nice little uh, design as well. There's the Blu-ray. So... Yeah, the body count continues and it has a nice Jason busting through the window towards the end of the movie. And it's in red. So they didn't just take a, pit, a still from the D Blu-ray 
or whatever and just chucked it on and he made a bit of an effort to colour it a bit so very nice indeed so yeah well happy I bought this steel book so my final thoughts definitely give it I'll give it a good eight and a half out of ten I will obviously it could have been a bit better with a different design and all that but for what they did very nice and especially the black having a bit of a pattern on the background as well if you like this video give it a thumbs up leave a comment and I will see you next time bye